Hi, I'm Rob, and these are the chords to Voices Carry by Till Tuesday. It's from their 1985 album, Voices Carry. And it's a request by Tony and Troy in Sydney, Australia. So, hi, Tony and Troy, and thanks for the request. Of course, I have the lyrics here, which I printed on the back of my Nirvana Breed lyrics, so I don't waste paper. And it's a great pop song. It's, a, it's one of my favorite songs, so... I'll just play a quick version of it for a minute and then I'll go through the chords, but um, basically I'm starting on a G and it sounds like this. I'm in the dark, I'd like to read his mind But I'm frightened of the things I might find Oh, there must be something he's thinking of Tear him away When I tell him that I'm falling in love Why does he say Hush, hush Keep it down now Voices carry Hush, hush Keep it down now Voices carry So, for the intro and the verse, I'm only strumming the low three strings. So the low E string, the A string, and the D string. Only those three strings. And I'm muting them, so I'm using the side of the palm of my hand. I'm just resting that on the bottom of the strings down here, just to, to mute them a little bit. So instead of sounding like this, a G chord sounds like this. Just so you can hear the difference. So we start on a G chord. Again, only the low E string, A string, and D string. So my finger's on the third fret on the low E string. To play a G note. My other finger's on... Um, my middle finger is on the second fret of the A string to play the B note and an open D. And I'm just doing down strums, down strokes. Now while I'm playing that, my index finger is on the first fret of the A string, ready and waiting. So I play the G, I lift my middle finger off of the second fret on the A string, and my index finger is already there on the first fret of the A string. So we're playing a B flat six. Then I'll add my pinky to the third fret of the A string to play a C9. And I'll lift my pinky put my middle finger back onto the second fret of the A string, back to the G. So that's pretty easy. Um, basically, the low G note, third fret on the low E string, and the open D are staying the same. Those aren't changing. The only thing that's changing is the A string. So if I were to only play the A string, it's 2nd fret, 1st fret, 3rd fret, 2nd fret, 2nd fret, 1st fret, 3rd fret, 2nd fret. So we put it all together. So that's the intro. It's the first half of the verse. So with the vocal, I'm in the dark, I'd like to read his mind But I'm frightened of the things I might find Then we go to a regular B-flat power chord, which is simple. My index finger is on the first fret of the A string. My other finger is on the third fret of the D string. To an F power chord. My index finger is on the first fret of the low E string. 
my other fingers on the third fret of the A string. So B flat power chord, F power chord, back to the G. When I tell him that I'm falling in love, why does he say? Build up on the G, go into the chorus. Hush, hush, keep it down now, voices carry. So it's an A minor 7, which I'm just going to play an A minor, but lift my finger off of the G string to get the open G in there. So A minor 7. So we start on A minor 7. Hush, hush. Go to a C major. Keep it down now. To a G major. Voices carry. Again, A minor 7. Hush, hush. Keep it down now. Voices carry. Oh, oh. And the chorus ends on this weird, altered, dissonant chord. So I'm going to call it an F with a diminished five and a major seven. Sounds complicated, but it's actually very easy to play. My index finger is on the first fret of the low E string. It's playing an F note. My middle finger is on the second fret of the A string, play a B note. My ring finger is on the second fret of the D string to play an E note. So I'm calling that an F diminish five with a major seven. And it's just a, an altered dissonant chord to add some tension at the end of the chorus. So, hush, hush, keep it down now, voices carry, oh, oh. Two, three, four, then back into the verse. Now at the end of the second chorus, we end on that altered F chord, and it goes into a bridge. Very simple. I'm just going to play a G chord. I'm just going to play a G bar chord. You could play a G chord, um, open chord if you want. To a B flat chord. I'm just going to slide up and play a B flat bar chord. Back to the G, back to the B flat, and that's it. So at the end of the second chorus, we end on that dissonant chord. One, two, three, four. He wants me. Seven. Hush, hush, keep it down now. Voices carry. And then it just does that, it keeps repeating. Hush, hush, shut up. 